Hi mom, I'm Alexa Mendez and this is the Weekly Watcher for Friday, October 24th, 2008. Or in other words, just one week until the second annual Weekly Watcher for The Dave Giant smashed his way into stores this week with the DVD and Blu-ray debut of The Incredible Hulk. If you still haven't picked up your copy yet, we won't judge. That's what the weekend's for. Head on over to Marvel.com for the breakdown of all the special features from each of the three editions you have to choose from, as well as word on retailer exclusives and more. While you're out getting your Hulk fix, don't forget to snag Spider-Man Web of Shadows, the wall crawler's latest video game adventure. Spidey must save New York from an invasion of alien symbiotes, but when his allies begin to succumb to the hostile invaders, how can we hope to succeed? <gasps> Marvel.com's newest exclusive digicomic, Marvel's Channel, Monsters, Myths, and Marvels, hits your computer screen this week, starring Gordon Ellsworth, a reporter intent on debunking the Galactus myth, and offering a more humorous take on our hero's universe that will cast a whole new light on some of your favorite stories. But that's just the beginning, true believers. Watch out for even more exclusive digicomics in the future, including American Eagle, just a little old-fashioned justice from Jason Aaron and Richard Eisenhoff, Fink Fang 4 by Scott Gray and Roger Langridge, Kid Cult, and a special Halloween special. Yep, I said it. We here at the House of Ideas released our January solicits this week, with Thor celebrating 600 issues, The Punisher kicking off his all-new series, The Superhero Squad Hero Up One Shot, and more. For a complete listing of Marvel's January comics, hit up our online catalog now. Take a trip to the future in the Weekly Watcher world premiere of Cable No. 9. Our hero must save the woman he loves and the child he's sworn to protect while Emma Frost and Cyclops put the screws to the renegade bishop. Don't miss Cable No. 9 when it makes its way to comics shelves on December 3rd. Now it's time for this week's stack. Do -do 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 -do. The Marvel heroes make their last stand against the Skrull Armada in Secret Invasion number no. 7, as one of the year's hottest stories draws closer to its conclusion. And the action doesn't stop there, with New Avengers number no. 46, Secret Invasion Spider-Man number no. 3, and Thunderbolts number no. 125, following the invasion through the rest of the Marvel U. It's a regular Brubaker Palooza this week, as Captain America number no. 43 brings Batrock the Leaper and Bucky Barnes together for the first time. Criminal number no. 6 continues Jacob K's bad night, and Lady Bullseye just won't give Matt Murdock a break in Daredevil number no. 112. Finally, everyone's favorite knucklehead gets embroiled in some San Franciscan ninja action in Wolverine Manifest Destiny number no. 1 from writer Jason Aaron and artist Steven Segovia. Now if you'll excuse me, I've got to get home so I can pop in my Incredible Hulk DVD, sit back and relax. Remember to come back next week for a second annual SPOOTACULAR And as always, for a full list of comics on sale, news and info on movies, video games and toys, along with thousands of digital comics, check out Marvel.com. I'm Alexa Mendez and this is Marvel, your universe. Marvel, your universe.